Eddie Mogul. That adorable little bunny is Russell Brand. You're watching Beyond the Trailer's review of Hop. Don't want to be the Easter Bunny. 4,000 years of tradition doesn't end just because one selfish bunny doesn't feel like doing it. My dad's right. I do need to get my act together. In Hollywood, all great artists suffer before they become famous. That lady wrote Harry Potter in a ditch. I have the talent. I have the drive. I have to avoid whatever that was. You know what? We can leave the insurance companies out of this. <laughs> Yes, Russell Brand has a hidden talent, voiceover artist. Because not only does he voice E.B. and Hop, but he was also the voice of Dr. Nefarious in last year's mega-hit animated film, Despicable Me. Amazing, right? And this talent couldn't have come at a better time, as Russell Brand's live-action career isn't doing so well. In fact, the British superstar is having trouble translating to American audiences, a problem he half-joked about, half-tried to fix in his Saturday Night Live monologue a few weeks ago. And now this month, Brand's two abilities go head to head. First his voiceover work here in Hop, and then the very next week his live action work in the remake of Arthur. The smart money is on Hop, as the talent is stacked highly in its favor. First of all, it's the second film from Hot to Trot Animation Studio Illumination Entertainment, their first film being Despicable Me. Second, it's directed by Tim Hill, the man who helmed the mother of all animation live action hybrids, Alvin and the Chipmunks. Third, Russell Brand isn't the only talented member of the cast. Backing him up in the recording studio is Hank Azaria, Hugh Laurie, and Laurie Metcalf. While on set, there's pretty boy-turned-comedian James Marston, Kaylee Cuoco from the hugely popular sitcom Big Bang Theory, Bill Hader, Chelsea Handler, Gary Cole, and David Hasselhoff. That's right, the Hoff. Finally, this movie is the cinematic equivalent of a peep, and it's got three whole weeks until Easter to rake in the dough and then some. Yes, the smart money is on Hop, although secretly, I bet Brand has his fingers crossed for Arthur. How was Hop? It was really awesome. But I liked it. How was Hop? Good. So, what did you think of the movie? Mm. Did you like it? Oh, why, thank you! Oh, thanks! What do you got there, Finn? Some candy. Oh, so you're like the Easter Bunny. Right? Mm -hmm. Did you like the way he gave out candy? Yeah. Yeah? My dad gave me tea all the time, and I drink some soda. Yeah? How was the movie that you saw? Good. I like so the fact that this one didn't have that bathroom humor. I don't, I don't like bathroom humor that much. <laughs> oh, from Alvin and the Chipmunks, you mean? Or? No, in general, in a lot of animated movies, there's a lot of bathroom humor. Oh, and this I don't didn't like have it? it? Yeah. Even though he poops jelly beans? Yeah, other than that. <laughs> Who was your favorite character? Chicken. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. The chicken? The dad. Oh, the dad? You liked him? The bunny dad or the human dad? The bunny dad. Yeah? What did you think of E.B.'s relationship with his dad? Is he a... It's great. Yeah? Oh, that's great. So is, so is you, you and your dad like E.B. and his dad? Um, yeah. Were you on the side of the bunnies or were you on the side of the chickens? Bunnies. Definitely. I would be on the bunny side. Oh, that's good. That's good. The chicks. Oh, you were on the chick side? Bunnies. Bunnies? Oh, were you on the side of the chicks? Oh, okay. So your brother was on the side of the bunnies and you were on the side of the chicks. What made you want to see it today? I just did. Yeah? Because that's why I love both CGI and, and live action. Oh, yeah, so you like that combo? It was good? Yeah. yeah. What did you think of Russell Brand as the voice of EB? <laughs> it was, he was very talented. Oh. He was amazing. He was good. Oh, great. I was surprised that he had also a live cameo. Oh, he did? Yeah. Oh, exciting. Oh, that's great. If you found EB the bunny, would you take him home with you? Yeah? Would you let him share your room? Yeah? I like the bunny drumming. You like the bunny drumming? Yeah. Yeah? Do you want to be a drummer? Oh, cool. Do you have some good moves? Do you think you guys could jam together? Well, what do you think of them kind of commercializing Easter more? They haven't really done that yet. Do you think it's a good idea? Or? I think it's a good idea. It should be just as, as, as important as, as Christmas or other, some other holidays, like youth uh, uh, kids' holidays. Yeah, right? I was doing Halloween. All the time to Halloween. Oh, for Halloween, right? Well, so now you're gonna. Do you think? Do you like? Does this movie make you like Easter more? Yeah. Yeah. It's a lot of fun. It's got bunnies and feuding chicks. Yeah. What do you give the movie on a one to ten? Ten. I would give it a ten. Probably an eight. How much did you like it? Did you like it a little bit? Did you like it a lot? Did you like it not at all? Did you not like it? What did you think? 
A little bit. A little bit? Okay, you liked it a little bit. I love it. I liked it. Oh, good. As you can see, everybody liked Hop. And I'm also proud to announce that because you demanded it, Movie Math is coming back in a fun and inventive way on Sunday, April 10th. Please mark your calendars, and I hope you'll tune in. I'm Grace Randolph reporting from AMC Empire 25, and you can go beyond the trailer for these other top movies. Thank <laughs> you.